Hey guys, it's me, Cindy, or Pink Juicy Fashion. But this is my vlog channel that I created. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, but can't you be weird on your vlog channel? I'm a very weird person. So, um, this is like my introduction video. But I don't want it to be that. I want to help you guys in my first video. A lot of people have been asking me on um, my main channel to do an um, organization video, but I don't really think it fits with the beauty thing, even though it's like organization with your school stuff and everything, kind of like what's in my school bag, but I just decided I put it up on my blog channel when I make my intro video. So I'm going to show you. First of all, I may or may not do a new What's in My School Bag because it's pretty much the same. But I just got a new backpack. This is my old backpack. But I switched my organization to make it a lot lighter because my binder was getting just so bad. Um, and then it has these cute leather straps on it. And they're really good. But the only thing is this bag is really small. It doesn't have a lot of compartments. It just has these two front ones. Well, it does have a lot of compartments. Just not big ones because, like, if you have your textbook and stuff. Because they have compartments on the inside right here. You guys can see them. Like that. And then... Right here, they just have the zipper pocket. But, like, if I have all my textbooks in there, like, all the ones I use at home, it's like, ah, cramming it in there because it's so small. So, let's get started with the organizer. One thing that I really like doing, and I didn't do it this year at first because, as you guys know, I originally had this binder. But, um... This is just way too hard to carry around. I love the inside. I'm sorry. It's just so cute. Look at it. I'm going to stop. So, like, this binder, I love it to death. It's adorable. But, sorry, I'm, like, obsessed with sticking my tongue out. But, so, it just got too hard because all the papers start falling out and everything like that. So, I switched. To this one. And I know these are a great idea. I there's some that are like even bigger than this one. Like like with more organizing because what this is is very good for organizing. But it's absolutely huge. Both of them. All of them. They're huge. Okay. What? Yeah, this. I switched over to this and I used it for a couple days because I used this in fifth grade and it was such sixth grade and it was such a good help. I used it for sixth grade. It for a little while because it got so big. So first of all it just has these like expandable folders. And then this like binder. And this is like a three subject binder. And then it zippers. And then it has this big pocket with like CDs. Cases. And like these like little tiny folder things. And there's three of them. And then there's just a zipper pocket on the front, which is huge. So, I mean, if you like these, don't, like, just take my word for it and just stop using them. I just think they're too big. Uh, because, like, I mean, if you have that much stuff, too, like, if you have a lot of stuff, they're big, they're, like, they fit perfectly. Um, but they're just so much to lug around. But if you have such little things, it's like, why even bother? So this is what I use. 
juice now. It's from Hot Chocolate, and you see this is also pretty, this is pretty beaten up. I used this as well in sixth grade because I'm like, used it in the beginning of the year, and then I switched to that one, and then I switched back to this one. And I love the Hot Chocolate brand for these. They're just so adorable. You can just get them at Target or Walmart. I don't know if I still have one, but I used to have this, like, brown one like this. And then it was, like, blue, and it had, like, polka dots. It was so cute. I probably still have it. But then it just, like, it goes like this, and it opens up, and it's an expandable flavor. And it has so many. Um, so I have it. From my first hour to my seventh hour without my extracurricular classes like French and stuff. Um, fourth hour, fifth hour is not in here. This is just my core classes, if you guys can see. And then like my extra classes, like my non-core classes are in this extra one. And I also keep, like, handouts and stuff in here. That's my schedule for chorus. Like, you can't stalk me. It's in code. Um, because, like, gym schedule. She takes us out of gym for extra course lessons. And then right here is my planner. And I colored it. But I'm not going to show you the front. So... Planners are so nice. Mine is school regulated, but like I write on these all the time. But um, I actually didn't highlight mine today, and it got me so confused. I have like this key, and then I highlight. I doodle it out. Um, so I highlight then like homework and stuff, but I didn't highlight today, and it gets me all confused. So yeah. And I also recommend if you have, like, a big planner or you've been, like, having the planner for, like, a really long time, um, I recommend using one of these, like, paper clip things because they help you get, like, right to the page and you can use it from the front or the back. So I just, because there's, like, one extra spot in the front, I put that right there so I have everything in order. And then it just closes real nice. Okay, another good thing is I don't like that getting too heavy because it will get heavy with um, all your papers and everything so you have to constantly clean it out just like a binder, just like any other folder um, because of all the papers. But I always, 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 like, if my friend forgets a spiral notebook or just a composition notebook or if I forget one to take to my class, we're not allowed back to our lockers. And I think that's with everyone. But so if I just need it, I just carry this folder and I'm in love with that now. Just kidding. Um, don't judge. And then I just keep loose leaf, like regular paper. And then I usually have graphing paper on the side because I need graphing paper for math, but I ran out. So I'm going to redo that tomorrow with refill. And then notebooks are like everything. You can't use binders with notebook paper or loose leaf paper. You're just going to lose everything. So notebooks, notebooks, and notebooks. And I don't like the subject ones, like the five subjects and stuff. And I need a five subject for math because it's my math book. So I got this one at Target and it's separated by the different colors. And it's blue, pink, green, and orange. And I have filled up the blue one. And it's actually four subjects for me because I actually pulled out a ton of this orange paper. First of all, orange is like my second favorite color and then it like... I was always writing on the back because I didn't want to write in the middle of my notebook in the middle of my notes and then tear it out. So, just these notebooks save your life. And this is going to be your early intro video. Bye!